Hey there Titans, in this video I'll show you how to set a dynamic file name to your attachment when it's sent via email. So we have here a very simple form with a, some PDF mapping, dynamic mapping, we're mapping an address and phone from the account and a signature and we have the form set up that it will send the email to uh, some email, additional emails it will send the form every time it's submitted with the attachment and if we will head over to the PDF mapping into the settings under email so we have an option here to set a dynamic file name so dynamic file name will give you hidden on your on your form I uh, just created a hidden that's called dynamic file name and let's see how we can map it so let's head over to our Salesforce integration. Set the get. We have some. We're just getting a random account. Head over to the mapping. Let's head over to the dynamic file name. And here you can either map it to a, a static field like the account name, or you can do FT custom, which will let you. Let's say. Let's do a account name. name and let's add you can add more fields you can add free text let's do signed a form and apply save this let's see how it does fresh the form form is pulling up all the data Let's sign, apply, and finish. Now the form will be submitted, and it will send it over to this email in a second. So th th this email I received before I um, before I set up the dynamic file name. So it just sent the attachment as signed form with with no name. And now here the new name will came up. So you can see that the name of the file is Gene Points signed form. PDF Gene Points is the is the account name and sign form um, is the text that I inserted into the dynamic file name and that's how you do it have fun.